teacher Kyle and I've been playing guitar for 14 years. Today I'm going to show you how to tune your guitar, read guitar tabs, and then use those tabs to play the Minecraft theme song, even if you've never touched a guitar before in your whole life. But first things first, let's get tuning. I recommend getting an electronic tuner like this. It'll show you exactly what notes you're playing. It just makes your life a whole lot easier. If you don't want to do that though, you can get the free guitar tuna app for your phone that looks like this. Standard tuning for the guitar from top to bottom is E, A, D, G, B, E. An easy way to remember that is elephants and donkeys grow big ears. Elephants and donkeys grow big ears. So now that we're all tuned up, let's learn how to read this guitar tab right here. Guitar tabs might be a little intimidating at first, but they're actually way easier to read than sheet music and they're made specifically for guitarists. Now there's a few things on here that might look familiar to you already. Like these six lines here, they match up with the six strings on our guitar. And they're even labeled E, A, D, G, B, E, just like we talked about earlier. Elephants and donkeys grow big ears. But you might have noticed it's upside down. So the string that's closest to your chest here is actually on the bottom. And the string that's closest to your feet is actually on the top. It's designed that way so that it looks like the neck of your guitar while you're facing down at it. So when you're facing down at your guitar, what you're seeing is this string here being on the bottom and then this string here being on the top. Now, these numbers that are written on the strings, those represent frets. Frets are the squares on the neck of your guitar in between these metal bars here. So this is your first fret, this is the second fret, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, all the way down the neck of your guitar. So when it says six on the high E string, we'll go to the string closest to our feet and count one, two, three, four, five, six. So now this is the note that we're supposed to pluck. So we only pluck that string and hold down the sixth fret. So you read this left to right, the same way that you would read anything. So the next note that we play is the 4th fret on the E string. So we were on the 6th fret, so to get to the 4th fret, let's just go down 2. And we'll pluck that one. Alright, the next one is the 4th fret on the B string, so we're already on the 4th fret. Let's just go up one string to the B string. Alright. Our next one is the second fret on the E string. So we're going back down to the E string to the second fret. So let's put that all together. Six, four, four, two. All right, the second part of it is mostly the same. There's just one note that's different. So we have six and four on the E string. Then we move to the B string and play four, two. So when you play this whole thing from left to right, you get six, four, four, two. 